Good morning campers. As you can see, I'm going to sit here in the shelter for a little bit. Probably 1 o'clock I'm going to head out. It's only 9 miles to the next shelter. I'm going to hike to that and spend the there. Then push into Fontana after that. But personally, I don't want to hike in this right now. I got soaked yesterday. So today I'm going to spend a Nero here at Sassafras Gap Shelter. So when the rain lets up, we'll be on trail. About 12 o'clock, tried to set the rain out. Uh, gonna hike up to the next shelter, which is about nine point something mile on day 17, March 3rd. Just give you a little view from the where the shelter's at. Up there, Screwball 2020. Go check his channel out. So, if I get any views, I'll be sure to bring to you. I'm up on top of Coach uh, something or other bald. Just after you pass uh, Sassafras Shelter. I bet there'll be a beautiful view here. But, like yesterday, I'm fogged in. Not as bad, so... This might blow out of here, so hopefully I'll get you some type of view. I'll see you down. Well, that's the name of the boat I was at that I showed you it was all fogged in. AT North. That away. That's where I'm heading. Fontana Dam, 20 miles. I should be there by tomorrow. I got you a little I got you a little bit of a view if you could see through them trees. I figure I'll give you a little bit of trail time. Throwing a bunch of little switchbacks right now coming down off the side of the mountain. This is what I have off to my left to look at it's better in person because you can see through the trees better the camera's not giving it justice but I figure I'll show you what I'm hiking in right now I don't know if you can see that sun coming up behind me in the middle of the afternoon that's a sure sweet sight for cold wet people uh, still on the trail haven't been really in good views um, that's where I came from that's where I'm going hopefully I'll catch you a good view with the sun breaking through the fog and everything uh, I'll see you on down the trail got you a little bit of a view out there Not that spectacular, but it's a nice view. Well, I got a 1.3 mile downhill trek to that road down there. And then uh, I got to climb up Jacob's Ladder. All right, back on. Well, I'm getting ready to climb up Jacob's Ladder. This was a Boy Eagle Scout project by this kid. He done it in 2010. From right here, these steps all the way up this mountain is a murder. Is, is are hard. So, probably no videoing. I'll catch it view for you. I just walked over a bunch of them little hills out there.
see the clouds in the back behind the mountains. That's pretty neat. Well, I just got up over Jacob's ladder. The beginning of it, it's pretty easy, nice, easy grade. Oh man, the last quarter of it, whoo, it's straight up. Almost hands and knees climbing up over it. It's a steep one. Unfortunately, all the way to the top, there ain't no views. There is kind of through the trees, but that's about all there is. All right, one down. So I'm here at Brown Fork Gap Shelter, Fork Gap Shelter. Uh, nine miles, almost 10 miles today. Jacob stairs, which kicked my butt. Uh, pretty good day. Like I, like I said this morning, I was hanging out at the shelter till it quit raining at Sassafras Shelter or something like that. And then rain let up, and it actually turned out to be a pretty good day. Tomorrow, I'm going to push into Fontana Dam. I'm going to spend the night at the shelter there. Then to the Smokies. Hope to see you on the trail.